Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Layla. If you're new here, hello. You should definitely consider joining the SP fam. This channel is all about bags and planners and everything related. And I do sometimes try to um, do other videos that people ask for or they want to see, even though it's not completely bag and planner related. So that's what this video is. This is going to be a skincare routine. So this is me in raw form tired <laughs> so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys um what products i use at night to go ahead and get my face taken care of to go to bed and then in the morning i'm gonna go ahead and record my morning routine to get myself ready for the day so if you are enjoying this video i hope you give it a thumbs up and that you like it and if you have um similar skin types or um just want to try out the products i do highly 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 recommend um these types of products that i use so the first one is going to be my Tatcha Rice Wash. This is what the bottle looks like. This is what I use at night. Um, I actually use maybe not a lot less, but a one less product at night than I do in the morning. It just, I don't know. I've played with the products that I have um, and other products that I was using, and this has been working well. This has been keeping my face clear <laughs> where people have been asking what my skincare routine is. So, um, I've never put my tripod on the bathroom counter before <laughs> when I recorded a skincare routine back in, um, I guess it was December for Vlogmas. I actually used my phone and I propped it right here on the flowers that are in the corner. Um, but I wanted to see if I could use the tripod and have it, you know, record on the camera. So we'll see how it goes. We'll go ahead and get started. So, um, I'm going to try and see if I can figure out how to do that whole voiceover thing. If you're not new here, my OGs, y'all know I've been playing with editing and trying to learn new tricks and stuff and teach myself how to do things. So if I can figure it out, I can, cause I figure, um, for some people, the water sound may be annoying, but I've watched other people's skincare routine videos and it didn't bother me. So I'm just going to go in and do it. So turn on my water and I usually wash my hands first. Um, this in case there's anything on it and just, you know, regular wash. I have Bath and Body Works, um, hand soap. I love all the lovely fragrances. So I buy them when they're on sale and I buy a whole lot. Um, so then I usually grab my little hair clip that I keep on my bathroom turnstile and I just pull this hair out of the way and I wash my son's hair tonight. So my hair is a little flaky and strange looking because I put too much powder on my hand. Ooh, it's taking a minute to get hot. Um, <laughs> and I don't have a towel, so I just rub the extra on my own hair. So that's why that looks so. All right, so that's starting to warm up. I do use um, pretty warm water, like close to hot, but of course not scalding. And I merely wet my face. Like so. And then I grab that Tatcha I just showed y'all. And I put about that much on the hand. Rub it together. And then I just start washing. Now, I didn't wear any makeup today. I don't wear makeup often. Turn this off. I don't wear makeup often. Uh, but when I do, and I'll show you guys probably in the morning because my hands are all wet now. But when I do, I start off with the Tatcha oil. Um makeup remover and then I follow up with a makeup eraser uh, washcloth so usually wash it like so and sometimes I go over my eyelids and close them and sometimes I don't it just depends on if I feel like I sweat a lot that day or if it's a day I did wear makeup so then I just rinse it off I just use my hands to do so. Try to get it, you know, out of my edges as much as possible. And that is the only wash that I do at night. So, I use a clean washcloth and have like an extra uh, stack I bought specifically for my face. Um, like different colors from the rest of the linen closet. So, I do like that. And for some reason, usually I have to wash my face, my lips feel chat. So <laughs> I usually put on a little chopstick, which I have extra in here. And then I am acne prone. So I use different gel. I get mine from CVS with coupons. Let me dry some of this water off my arms. 
So I just do one pump like so and I rub my hands together and then I usually just kind of put on my face. And then I've recently learned that rubbing your face all kind of different ways actually disturbs it and causes more acne. So I go in the same manner every time. I basically like paint my face, if that makes sense. Um, I took my daughter to a dermatologist appointment quite a few months ago and that's what we learned. That is best to paint your face. So I usually do that. And then I also have the Tatcha Lip Therapy. So usually why the different gel is drying pretty good, I'll go ahead and apply this. Um, but I'm probably gonna go get a snack, so I'm probably not gonna put this on. <laughs> um, but this is the lip mask that I use, and this is like the tiny little applicator that it comes with. So you merely just, you know, dip it in, and then I just paint it on. And then I just hand wash these and use the next one the next day. So this is a part of my skincare routine at night. It's the little lip therapy. And so just a few seconds of letting the different gel just kind of dry in, usually makes my face feel, you know, a little tight. And I know that it's gonna be doing its job. Then I go in with my evening cream. So although I have very oily skin, I found that using this Tatcha uh, Dewy Skin Cream is best at night for me because it applies a lot of moisture and it hydrates very well and it kind of gives me that glow and it just kind of rejuvenates my face overnight. So I usually get about, I'm trying to show you guys, <laughs> sorry, like that much and I just put it on my other hand. There's usually some left on my finger and I just kind of wipe it on there, but I kind of dab a little bit and then I just start painting. So I go all around my face in the same manner I did with the different gel and making sure that I have it everywhere and especially the edges of my face because sometimes that is where the different gel and even like the daytime cream I'm gonna show you in the morning, it will show a little bit white from it drying um, and you know, you don't wanna leave it like that. So that's it y'all. <laughs> that is literally all I do to my face at night. Um, and then like I said, I am going to film in the morning in my raw form, fresh out the bed, um, what I do for in the morning, which is just, there's, I do like a two cleanser step system in the morning and then I use, you know, a different cream for acne during the day and then I use a different moisturizer for during the day. But this is the first half, so see y'all in the morning. Okay, so this is me, raw in the morning, tired, <laughs> not a morning person. So first, I brush my teeth and stuff, which in the evening routine I do too. I brush my teeth first so that all the water and stuff that's all over your face is already taken care of. So I usually wash my face with my, you know, washcloth that matches my towel. You know, get all the crusties <laughs> and sleepies out of your eyes and stuff. Um, and then, like I said, I normally put on some chapstick just because my lips always feel tapped. So I put a little chapstick on um, and I put my contacts in. So I already put in my contacts and so we're gonna go ahead and get started with the face. So let me grab fresh washcloth for drying. Go ahead and put this one out of the way. Alright, go move that washcloth out of the way. So get some hot water on. And the first one for the morning is this one. So this is the Tasha Deep Cleanse. And I'm gonna show you the other one because I take the tops off. It's kind of wet my hands. The second one is this one. This one is called a Tatcha um, Deep Polish, right? Yes, the rice, well, the rice polish deep. That's what it's called, the rice polish deep. Sorry about that. So I step around the side, it's ready to go. Water is warm. This water is warmer than I like it. It's pretty freaking hot. It's a hot fast this morning. Alright. Alright, so wet to my face. Like before. And then this one, squeeze like that. Usually about that much from the other. And same as last night. So uh, not a morning person. I hate getting up, so I'm not usually talkative, but like I said last night, 
I did want to get this video out to those who asked about my skincare routine and I don't know how to do voiceovers just yet so I wanted to go ahead and talk just in case I don't figure out how to do it while I'm editing this video. It can already be here. So the dermatologist told my daughter and I, um, my daughter has eczema and uh, her acne was out of control. So that's why we went for her. And the funny thing is what the dermatologist recommended ended up not even working. It made it worse. So we stopped the products and the dermatologist visits. But the tip she gave us as far as cleaning your face definitely helped. So she said, when you're cleaning, you can go any kind of way that you want. Up, down, side to side, all of that. But when you're putting on your creams and moisturizers, you need to like paint your face. So we wash all over the place. And then you go. showed you now this one's a powder so you have to pour out like a little bit of powder and I always try to be gentle because I'll shake out way too much and these products are an arm a leg and a vagina okay <laughs> they are not cheap but I tried drop of water not I tried like the trial sizes first which are like 10 12 and 15 dollars um just to see if it would work if I liked it and I fell in love and I continue to use it and my skin cleared up. It is awesome. So this one is a powder and then it turns into a soap. So I wash like so. I used to go over my eyes a little bit with this one sometimes in the mornings. Go ahead and close them. And then it goes off. And there's no set time for like how long I wash anything. It just depends on how much time I got, if I'm in a rush, but usually it's a couple of seconds or so. Other thing the dermatologist told us is not to rub dry, um, but to pat dry. So pat everywhere. Oh, get the water off my arms because it likes to run down my arm as I'm doing it. So get that off quickly. And then my daytime acne med is this one. This was sent to me um, in a Ipsy bag back when I was trying to figure out what products work for me. Do about that much. Um, and I was like, shit, what I got to lose? My face looks like a damn crunch bar. So I painted on, like the dermatologist said. But I decided to try it since it was in the pouch. Um, my chin area was a huge issue. I guess, I don't know, it was either the mass knee or just adult acne or a combination of both, but it came in an Ipsy pouch or bag, whatever. And I decided, it's already in here, I already paid for it, I might as well try it, I ain't got nothing to lose, I already look terrible. So I started using it and I love it. So I'm just gonna close these bottles, which is what I normally do, close them and dry off the bottom, the water and stuff. I stopped waiting for the space one to dry. But, um, <clears throat> That stuff is amazing. <laughs> it absolutely clears me up. Um, it's a little bit more drying, in my opinion, than the different gel. Um, my face, the one that I use at night, the different gel, this one, I feel a little bit tighter. And if y'all remember last night when I was talking about covering stuff, so a couple of the areas do turn um, a little bit white. So I do um, make sure I get the cream on there pretty good. So that one, same thing, just takes, you know, a few seconds to dry. You can see that it's already dry and face feels a little tight. So then this is the daytime cream. So it's another water cream by Tatcha, but this one is the regular. So this one is for like, you know, regular skin or oily skin. 
or even I think normal to oily is what it's called or combination skin. So this one is a great one. Again, I use the other one at night because it's the deep. So it's actually for dry skin, but I use it at night so that I get the maximum hydration and moisturization at night. So same thing, I go in the same motions, kind of like downward painting. And then of course, kind of like windshield wipers <laughs> on my big old forehead. So on like so kind of crusty here and that's it y'all that is my skincare routine <laughs> i was using a lot of products around christmas time because i was reading about how to fix acne and how to do it and they were like you know as you get older your skin is not turning over as fast and it may need exfoliation and all of that so i was using all kind of abrasive products trying to rejuvenate my skin and it just was not a good idea but the actual japanese rice that is in these products is gently exfoliating as well as super moisturizing so these products i highly recommend um like i said they are expensive they cost an arm a leg and a vagina for real for real so may not be something that you can afford or something that you want to pay for at first i didn't that's why i bought the trial products first so i could go ahead and try it um and like the travel size ones so they're like ten dollars each i think one might be 12 one might be 15. so they're not super cheap either they add up if you buy a couple products but i would start with maybe one or two products of theirs some type of cleanser and some types of moisture some type of moisturizer um if you're interested in trying them and just see how it goes for you you know it's, it's you're not going to know if it works until you try it i didn't know until i tried it um it wasn't recommended to me by anybody i just was watching what's in my bag videos like always and sometimes you know when you're doing your purse you start talking about other stuff as you're pulling stuff out and she was talking about her face and masking and all that and how she tried it and it worked i'm like shit what i got to lose so that's what i did <laughs> i'm gonna be sure to try to link everything down below um i gotta hurry up and get ready for work so i'm gonna go ahead and sign off but i hope you guys enjoy the video and i'll see y'all in the next one bye